uh, hi friends in this video we will see how to create a tailgate cover i have already created a frame this frame in my previous video i have shown you how to create this frame okay now i will show you how to create cover on this tailgate okay uh, this is how it looks this is how it looks this cover okay these things we learn how to join this cover okay join these two parts okay this is tailgate frame and uh, this is tailgate cover let's start initially i have created one point see this point sorry this point this is origin first point is this is origin point zero 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 and this is my second point is minus 120 mm minus 120 in x direction and z is 300 mm okay. and i created with three lines with x y and z direction okay. and same way i created the planes with respect to x y z this is x y and z line okay this is these are reference points okay this is my reference frame previous frame now we will start how to create the cover on this frame actually usually in design process first they will create the cover so that the cover is class a surface this is class b inside it is inside the car door car tailgate we can call it as tailgate The 25 degrees angle and create 25 degrees angle. We will see whether if it is 25 is okay or we can increase from there also. Here, this is 20, and the horizontal distance from here to here is 40. Okay, exit from this sketch and take this sketch from this plane projection point parallel to plane I'll hide this and create one arc Coincide this arc with uh, this line. Okay. Horizontal distance is sixteen hundred and even sixteen hundred. Okay. And uh, radius of this one is four thousand. Okay. Now in sweep, take the sweep command. First option. Select this first sketch, and guide cut as second sketch. Okay. Now it is touching here, right? You can do one thing. You can increase this angle. Uh, 
and one more thing we can give this height 320 mm like this okay now give this take sweep command select with the draw direction like this and select this line with an angle of 3 degrees One fifty, one fifty, or two hundred M. Okay. Now, take another sketch. Projection point parallel to line. Okay. Now create the same mark. Previously we created right like this give the distance of 150 symmetry select both sets allow symmetrical line okay sixteen hundred four thousand Still, there is like less distance between first frame and this one. You can do, you can give frame as other color. Okay. Surface, surface. Minimum distance two mm only. Minimum distance is two mm only. So we can increase this angle. First sketch. I'm going to first sketch. Increase this angle. Twenty eight. Now again, I will measure this one. This frame for mm possible can increase this angle twenty nine. Okay, now we will create another sketch that is. will project this one this sketch on this surface along a direction this direction okay trim this again sweep command give direction as this one and can give a test at 10 degrees drop down by 100 okay if we think this angle is more we can reduce this angle to 3 Okay, now give the proper fillet. I'll join these surfaces.
uh, one more thing we need to create draw direction for this part okay previous part for that what i will do just i will take one line select this curve and the starting point is this one and support is plain okay i will give 45 degrees angle it's 45 right This is the draw direction for this part. Okay, we are we are in this right. No. Create one boundary. Okay. Sweep. Take this way. And draw direction is this one. Give an angle of at least ten degrees. You see, ten degrees angle. Okay. Now, what I will do? I will take the offset this one at least 10 mm offset outside okay no hide initial offset trim this this cover portion trim with the surface okay define here we can give offset of 20 mm okay this flange we came right Offset this surface, the cover surface, with 1.2 mm. Offset this surface with 1.2 mm. Check whether inside or outside it is. Inside you have to offset. Just trim this. Define here. Trim this part with this offsetted surface. Okay. Now same. Trim this cover. This offsetted surface with this one. Okay. No one flange is created, right? See, this flange is created. This is important here. One basic shape form. Okay. 
now I want this flange offset of 1.2 mm again This is required here. Okay. I will offset this with 1.2 mm inside. All surfaces are confusing right this is my initial surface this is the trimmed surface okay this is my flange surface okay now I will join these three and give some fillet maybe this video will be bigger please watch video fully so that you will understand We'll give some tenon and fill it. Okay. This flange is created here. Okay. This is what we required. This distance is one point two mm. It is
this should offset Now what I will do, I will join these two surfaces. See this flange, I will split this fan this flange. Sorry. I will join these two surfaces this one and this one section Now I will join these three surfaces. This one, this one, little one, and this one. Something wrong, maybe heaven. Instead of creating multi section, we can do another thing. Just I took this boundaries flange okay curvature continuity and continuity okay same way bottom bottom surface also need to extrapolate extrapolated these two Initially, we offset this surface, right? We will offset it by two or three mm again. Three mm.
now I will trim these surfaces extrapolated surfaces with this offset surface first one okay same way trim this with this one now I will again trim this surface this surface with this one reverse direction ok this surface with my internal surface ok now I will get a smooth surface here join these three four three elements okay give some fillet Before giving the fillet, just check if there are any tangential continuity missing. See, here it is missing the tangential continuity. So we can give some bigger fillet here. Check the other side also, same missing the tangential continuity. Now, if I give one more fillet. Okay. No proper flange is created. See. See in between them. Between them, one flange is created. If I thicken the surface, it should be more clear. I will thicken this surface with one mm thickness. This is a tail gate. See, now it got some shape. Uh, I have created one small sketch. This is 200 mm, and I have given a fillet here is 15 mm on each corner. Length is 200, and width is 80 mm. Just I will project this sketch, a rectangular sketch on this surface or I'll do one thing extrude it just to split this surface this surface this one Select this as the draw direction. Wait a fill it up. Sketch and give 
draw direction is this one. Now let's change. Okay. Ten degrees. That's okay. See parallel. We'll come to now. No. You fill this surface. It's not clear. Right. Projection point. Line. And this one. Just to draw one line. If possible, draw some vertical line. Extrapolate, extrude, and CMB. Join this trimmed surface with this one. Give some fillet. It looks fine, so okay. Now create some more, one more future. I'm not giving proper dimensions now.
in the same way give root fillet fillet place major role Just project this sketch on this surface. Let the direction. Okay. Same. Give sweep. Same way, give one line. Just to draw a line. and you extrude this line to match here up to here trim this Same way, this should be a little nearer. Okay, again, this mirror, this one. Again, trim this part with the mirror part. Okay, now join these surfaces. Give the fillet. Now give some thickness to this part. Pencil one M thickness. Okay. So, aha. Uh -huh. There is a problem here. So we need to move the sketch somewhat inside. Mm, not this one. Before this one sketch. See. Clear? Okay. And one important thing I will show you flange. See how it is created. 
this flange all around increase okay guys thank you please subscribe to my channel and i am creating a series of uh, videos uh, like one is created and with respect to other part i am creating see initially i created this this part when two videos now i am creating above this part and if possible i will create uh, some more mountings here and uh, in further videos i can create surrounding surface also but i need your support okay please subscribe to my channel thank you guys